Car and Driver magazine performed an experiment to document just how dangerous texting and driving can be in comparison to the widely known risky activity of drunk driving. During the experiment, cars were rigged with a red light to alert drivers when to brake. The magazine tested how long it would take to hit the brakes when sober, when legally impaired with a blood alcohol level of .08, when reading an email, or when sending a text message. Sober, focused drivers took an average of a half a second to brake. For legally drunk drivers, four feet needed to be added to the stopping distance. An additional 36 feet was necessary for reading an email, and a whopping 70 feet needed to be added to the stopping distance when sending a text message. In summary, a texting while driving is even worse than drunk driving when it comes to reaction times. Good morning, LHS. 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 Today is Friday, April 21st, 2017, and for your dying pleasure today, we have brunch. Lions Read Club members, please finish your posters for the All Read if you are able to. Please check the overdue list that is posted outside of the library because there's a lot of overdue books right now. If you would like to be a freshman mentor next year, please go see Mr. Van Dalen or Jordan Brockmeyer to get your paperwork. Students attending prom, you need to bring your ASP card to the dance so you're able to get in. Check the HSB Center for more job openings. After school tutoring is still on Mondays and Wednesdays after school in Mr. Van Der Veen's room. And there are no birthdays today. Have a great weekend. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. 